Well, after that disappointing exercise three, let's try exercise four and see if I can feel better about myself. Uh, I'm thinking it might be the updates in Jasper Active where they have had it has you open the hyperlink documents as a web page. Uh, I'll probably go back and look at it later. If I can fix that one, I will. But in the meantime, let's move on uh, with the workbook properties here in exercise four. Oh, good. All right, great. Well, that's already not working. Let's try again. Exit without submitting. I feel like I didn't even click that and this popped up. Let's try that one more time. I don't know why it opened up weird, but I don't feel like playing along today. Assessing workbook properties. Let's do this thing. There it is. Maybe that has something to do with why I got the last ones wrong. Okay, here it says, in File Explorer, navigate to the starter files. So File Explorer is down here. And we're going to do, let's see, starter files. And there's two. And they want you to right-click the financial statement properties file. And then go down to properties. And here we can read through the general properties. Let's look at the details. Title, nothing, nothing, nothing. Categories, not much. Scrolling down through, <clears throat> see it's 8.72 kilobytes, tiny little file. Uh, click cancel to get out of there. Now we're going to open financial statement properties save it in the my projects folder hmm interesting financial statement properties and save it file save as or save a copy in the my projects folder so i'm just going to take this do they have us change the name it doesn't look like it save okay all right so with it open go to file info and properties let's do advanced properties and type the following in title Colano adventures subject financial statement your name Category financial links website income keywords statement balance sheet and click each of the tabs to view what's on them. Okay, that was good enough for me. And then click OK. And notice as soon as we did that. They were modified, so let's say, oh, I'm just gonna click the save button right up here. So save it, close the workbook. Then in File Explorer, navigate to the My Projects folder. There it is, right click it, go to Properties, and details and notice everything we just typed in there is listed and there you go click cancel to close it and close file explorer i'm going to close that too everything's closed close 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 and let's submit it and get it About time I see another 100%. All right, so let's call that good for this video.